Okay, to start off this video, I just want to point out that I'm not being paid by anybody to say things about this company, and you're going to get an honest opinion. What happened was, a company reached out to me from seeing my videos on YouTube and asked me if I would like to test the product for them. So, I'm going to do that. The company is V Leading Elux, and this is going to be the package that we unbox. So stick around, see what I think, and watch to the end to figure out how you can save 20% and get some free products. sell their product through Amazon. It did come in an Amazon package. This is not the Amazon package. That being said, I really wish there was some branding on this box. Maybe some directions on it or whatever. You have the branding on this sticker and the sticker also does say something about their lifetime technical support and one year warranty, which is nice to have a one year warranty and support if you don't know what you're doing. This light is a smaller light. It's meant for planted freshwater aquariums, and it's going to be going on the five gallon, which I currently have my Kessel on, so it has a big name to keep up with. Just open this up. Just some thin bubble wrap. I don't know. I'm sure if I uh, could use some styrofoam. But it's here. It's all in one piece. It's got a gooseneck on it. You can bend it in all different kinds of ways, you see. Big screw here. It is small, so if you do have a rimmed aquarium, it's probably not going to fit over that. Thankfully, the five gallon is rimless. So it did come boxed up pretty neatly. I do like how easy this is to bend. You can bend it in any way you want, really. So you can have it facing however you would like. You can have a way above the aquarium like so. Maybe down almost on top of it. Very easy to maneuver. And... The wire comes all nice and neat for you. I probably won't be using all of this wire, so I'm going to leave that little zip tie on. And there's a little button. Just one singular button. I'm assuming that's your on and off button. So we're going to go over to the 5 gallon aquarium right now. I do have the tuna sun on it. We're going to leave it on. We're going to show you guys what that's like, and we're going to compare this little guy to the tuna sun. So here's the 5 gallon. It's a marine land portrait tank, so it's five gallons tall, not your standard, which would be a little bit lower. Do have the Kessel Tuna Sun A160WE on here, which is a $250 light, which is a little bit overkill, but everything in here is doing good. I do know I got that black hair algae over there. That's disgusting, but we're going to be taking care of that in another video. I just kind of wanted to show you guys how well the Tuna Sun lights this aquarium. So I gave you the price point on the Kessel and showed you how it looked like and I wanted to do that just to put something into perspective for you. That light is $250 light. This light is $21. And if you stick around to the end of the video, you'll be able to figure out how to save 20% which makes it $16.80 and you'll be able to get some extra parts. Alright, so I got the tuna sun off of the aquarium and this is literally just going to go behind here and slide on in the back. And what's pretty cool about if you have this marine land portrait, you can just remove your back lid like this. A bunch of fanciness to the back of this thing to make it better. I'll make a video on that in the future for you guys. So this will fit perfectly right here. And slide right onto the back. And you just take this little screw, just tighten it. You get it nice and snug. Easy to turn. Best part about this is, once you get it on there, you'll actually be able to use your back cover. As opposed to most lights, this will not fit. This is usually a lot bigger and it won't allow this back cover to stay on. Definitely got to say, upon appearance, the V leading light is far more sleek. You can almost hardly tell. You can see that Kessel plain as day. Now we take the Kessel off, it just looks a lot better. A lot more clean in there. Before we get this light turned on, I just want to make it known that I absolutely 100% know that this light isn't going to be anything close to the Kessel. I mean, there's that big of a price difference for a reason. I just wanted to make that clear. Alright, it's time for the big reveal. And, alright, that's pretty dark. That's a bunch of red light right there. That's almost like a natural sunlight. It's kind of brighter than I thought it was going to be, to be completely honest. I'm still thinking, let's see what this button does. Off, on. Oh, it changes the color light, so let's see. Two, 
three. All right, so we got three color lights. We have this, which is a lot of white and blue light. This here has a little bit more red light added to that. And there's just white and red light. So I think, I don't know. I think I like this one right in the middle. It is bright enough. I do think this is gonna be more of a low to medium light plant light. I'm not sure how well this carpet's gonna do down here. Look at him. What a stunner. Need a name for him, guys. If you wanna come up with a name for him, let me know in the comments. But I don't know what the Scarlet Temple, how red that's gonna stay, nor do I know how this carpet is gonna to continue to carpet. So I'm just gonna keep this here light on the tank for a month or so, and then I'll make another video and let you guys know my long-term thoughts and opinions. If you're interested in getting this light for one of your aquariums at home, whether it be a nano aquarium like I have, or a slightly larger aquarium, I'm gonna leave a few things to help you out down in the description. I'm gonna leave the link for the light, as well as I'm gonna leave an email for you for V Leading. If you just send them a message and tell them the Aquapapa sent you, they're gonna be able to work out a deal with you as well as I'm going to leave one-time promo codes. So all of these codes that are gonna be in the description can only be used once. Not by two people, just once. So if you guys got this Marine Land Portrait Tank or any nano aquarium, I think this light would be a great, cheaper alternative for a brighter light. It definitely shows the colors of the fish well, and I'll be back with another video in about a month, like I said, to let you know how it does with plant growth. Until next time, guys. Peace.